Well, this summer, locals have found an exciting new way to enjoy the Washita River. News 12's Drury Vaughn visited this morning before all the rain, and he shares one way you can stay cool with Washita River floats. As the summer heat rises throughout Texoma, many locals are looking for ways to cool off. What better way to do that than a relaxing four-mile float down the Washita River? It's got to be just a really big deal. It's just relaxing and fun. And uh, you give an Okie a tube and you put him on the river, or a Texan a tube and you put them on the river, they're happy as they can be. Owner Ricky Ellett says storms caused rising water levels that delayed the opening of the Washita River floats on Memorial Day weekend. But calmer waters on Sunday brought in visitors from across multiple states. We want them to have a relaxing experience and we're going to come pick you up. You're not going to have to drag and walk and carry nothing. Located just a half mile from Turner Falls Park, up to 180 visitors can enjoy a relaxing four hour float downstream, ride on the river wagon and spend time swimming with friends on the sandbars. Kids have fun, the adults have fun, the college kids, they come down here and have a blast. And so it's, it's just a fun deal. Visitors from Bells made the trip on Sunday enthusiastic about their first experience on the river. Uh, it's quiet, quiet. There's a lot of nature here. It's very, very cool. Friendly people. Uh, it was really calm. Like there was points where I probably could have fell asleep. Ellett says you can make a reservation to float by reaching out to their Facebook page. Uh, starting Thursday, we're going seven days a week and we'll be open seven days a week till the end of September. September 30th will be our last day of floating. In Davis, Jury Vaughn, News 12.